Top Golf officially taking flight in Louisville this week. WDRB Stefan Johnson shows us what the company is doing to prepare for players, parties, and even pop-ups. Behind me, you can see the construction is just about finished. So this week, Top Golf is focused on bringing in employees and customers. Every weekend. Donald Robinson Jr. is a self-proclaimed weekend golfer. And I've been playing for over 20 years now. And he's not against taking a few swings during the week. So if I can play during the week, uh, I can, but it has to be after five after I get off. That's why Robinson loves Top Golf. I have a Top Golf app where wherever I go, it it identifies where Top Golf is at, and I, I hit the app and uh, it gives me directions right to the uh, facility. And now the app includes Top Golf at Oxmoor. This is our our second week in town. Holly Paterno is director of operations for Top Golf and explains why it's a big week for the company and anyone looking for a job. Uh, so we're hiring over 500. Monday, Top Golf officially started hiring for the three-story golf entertainment complex in the old Sears wing at the Oxmoor Center. We are hiring now and then training kicks off at the end of the month. Paterno says to apply, go to topgolf.com, type in Louisville, and the job you want. And within 24 hours, we're going to send them a text message that says, hey, we'd love for you to come out and join us at one of our hiring events that will take place here. Top Golf has also started selling and scheduling events. So we offer events anywhere from 12 to really 800 people. Um, so a lot of socials. We have lots of inquiries coming in. Can I host my holiday party with you? And I'm really excited about Top Golf coming to Louisville. Meanwhile, Donald Robinson says Top Golf will actually give him a chance to spend more time with his wife and children. You can go out, have a good time, uh, hit some golf balls, have some great food, and, uh, and just have a good time. Right now, there's no firm date for the grand opening, but a spokesperson for the company says it will happen before the holidays. With photographer Jeff Gordon, I'm Stefan Johnson, WDRB News.